If you're new to Dynamics 365, the first thing you'll want to do is establish your initial settings. To do that, click the gear icon and then click Personalization Settings. Set your default pane, usually to sales if you can see it. If you're using a power app, you might see something else here. And that's referring to this page at the bottom. Then select your default tab. As you can see, the tab lines up with the navigation bar. So wherever you like to start, let's say it's accounts, click that. Make sure your records per page is set to 250. That's the maximum right now, although that's changing. Set your advanced find mode to detailed. That's changing as well. And then set your time zone. Next, you wanna click on email and make sure to turn off the create button. What this will do is try to create contacts from your emails automatically. And you may find out you'll end up with contacts that you don't really want in your CRM system. So it's best to just turn those off. And then lastly, allow other Microsoft Dynamics users to send email on your behalf. That's really nice for automated emails that the system creates. Sometimes those emails come from a generic user, but sometimes it looks better if they come from you. Checking this box will allow that to happen. And that's it. Just click OK and you're done.